Hi everybody, my name is Kando. Uh, please subscribe to my channel and like this video, hit the notification bell and uh, give me a comment and uh, do all those uh, online things and follow me on whatever platform you're following me on. Yeah, so I've just come out from the gym Yeah, with Coach Rabi. It was lit, you know, like um, it was on just from the beginning up to the end. I'm seeing the benefits of doing workout daily, so my body is like adapting to to the daily workout, you know, so it's becoming stronger. I hope bigger, but hey, in a way I can see yeah, there's some muscles in, in certain areas which have really developed and, and, and I love that. I love that. You know, I'm grateful to, to my higher power and I'm grateful to the guys at RA Gym, you know, like for just being there for me. Yeah, uh, the other thing that's going on through my head is I had a very unique experience yesterday of experiencing like meeting a person who had gone first into Al-Anon and then they found themselves in in Sex Addicts Anonymous, you know, so like, um, you know, in the recovery um, 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 community, there's always this debate of whether people are pure addicts, like pure alcoholic or pure uh, drug addict and things like that, you know, and my experience is proving it, it's just not like that. You know, anybody can be addicted to anything at any time. You know, my my addiction, you know, the, the, the big addiction I had was alcohol. But at, at a given moment, I could go into any other addiction, you know. And uh, I keep proving this, even with my sponsees, with my clients. I, I, I keep proving this, you know, whereby, you know, um, uh, they, there's always something going on. For as long as I'm not engaging in the activities which my recovery demands, I'll find myself going into into other addictions. So I just have to be really like aware and active in working against my addiction. So basically working for my recovery. As long as I'm working for my recovery, I'm okay, you know. But the moment I stop, something creeps in. It might not be the alcohol, it could be anything, literally anything. One um, person in recovery and who is like a forerunner in a lot of things regarding addiction, um, Dr. Patrick Cairns, he said there's about 200 and something, you know, different addictions which have officially been identified. So um, I just have to stay on the recovery path, you know, and exercise is one thing that is really helping me. There's a reading I read the other day she was talking about how exercise actually helps you know spiritually as well and um, addiction is a spiritual problem you know so which means it needs a spiritual solution and exercise can be helpful in that in in, in that in that area but if uh, a lot of people who have come out of addictions will, 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 will tell you that just one activity is not enough you know it will go together with prayer with meditation with reading you know with with fellowship, you know, like uh, interacting with other people who are in a similar problem and also with just acts of kindness, you know, so it, it all goes together. And uh, yeah, that's just the way it is, you know, for, for a person who has had um, a serious addiction like me to stay away from, from getting back into it. Yeah, so it's a lovely morning. Have a great day, people. And... Uh, Thanks for letting me share. Please hit the subscribe button, give me a comment, and please follow me on whatever platform you are watching me from.